Expert. Prigozhin's move to Belarus might be a strategic one by Putin and could endanger NATO countries. Yevgeny Prigozhin, the chief of the Wagner Group, may have relocated to Belarus as part of a larger plan by Russian President Vladimir Putin to weaken Ukrainian defenses. It is a strategic move to beef up Russian force posture and open a second front for Western Ukraine war, said author and former DIA intelligence officer Rebecca Koffler. Koffler said her intelligence analysis has her leaning to believe, the revolt was not authentic. My intel analysis suggests the coup attempt was false flag operation, said Koffler. It is a strategic move to beef up Russian force posture and open a second front for Western Ukraine war. The president of Belarus, Alexander Lukashenko, acknowledged on Tuesday that Prigozhin had arrived in his nation after launching a coup in Russia the previous weekend. Koffler's remarks coincide with that announcement. The head of the Wagner Group is apparently in Belarus as part of an agreement made with the Kremlin to go there in exile in return for immunity from prosecution, but his presence there puts NATO neighbors on edge. We are closely monitoring the situation and are fully prepared to react should the situation require, a Lithuanian official told regarding Prigozhin's move to Belarus. Koffler asserts that nations like Poland and Lithuania, which border Belarus to the west and north, respectively, are entitled to have their suspicions about the move and are probably already debating how to strengthen security. The day before Prigozhin arrived in Belarus, he made a speech outlining his justification for the brief rebellion claiming that the invasion of Russian cities and the hasty march on Moscow were an effort to show the worth of his soldiers. The Wagner Group leader did not acknowledge any deal with Putin to end the uprising, instead saying that he stood down in an attempt to prevent any Russian bloodshed. However, Koffler said that, Prigozhin cannot be trusted any more than Putin, arguing the Wagner Group leader is only honest about his work on behalf of Mother Russia. And Mother Russia is now Putin. Putin also aims to hold at risk NATO's eastern flank. It is why he recently gifted tactical nuclear weapons to Alexander Lukashenko, the president of Belarus, Koffler said in response to the speech. Koffler thinks Prigozhin's presence in Belarus will set in action a far bigger scheme, 